Okay, so formulas will be given on the test, and some of them did not upload onto this document, so let me fill those in for you. This one is S squared radical 3 over 4. Area of a circle is pi r squared. Circumference is 2 pi r. Volume of a cylinder is pi r squared h. Volume of a sphere is 4 thirds pi r cubed. And the volume of a cone is 1 third pi r squared h. So our first question is asking about geometric mean. Geometric mean is when we do um, a mean proportion, but the means are the same. So we want this number and this number to be the same. And this is a 4 and this is a 49. So we would cross multiply and get x squared is equal to 4 times 49, which is 196. When we take the square root of 196 and the square root of x squared, we get x is equal to plus or minus 14. On our second one, we're going to do the same idea here. We are going to cross multiply, but make sure we put these guys in parentheses. So now we're going to cross multiply here. So it will be 9 times x minus 5y equals 7 times x minus 3y. Then we will distribute 9x minus 5y equals 7x minus 21y. Then I'll combine like terms. So I'm going to add a 5y to both sides and subtract a 7x. That means these will cancel and these will cancel. So I'll have x's on one side, 2x equals y's on the other side, negative 16y. I want the ratio of x to y, so that means x stays on top, which means I have to put y on the bottom, so I do that. I gotta get rid of the two in front so I have an x to y ratio is equal to negative 16 over 2, which would reduce to negative 8 over 1. On number 3, it tells me a similarity statement. So I'm going to use that similarity statement to write some equations. And it looks like I'm trying to find the value of x, so I wanted to see what if fg and bc go together. So FG are the two in the middle, BC are the two in the middle. So I'm going to say 8 is equal to 2X minus 2. Add 2. 10 equals 2X, so 5 is equal to X. Okay, on number 4 it says in the figure to the right, QA equals 20. Find AD. So this guy right here. So I'm going to set up a proportion that's going to go this over this equals this over this. So 7 plus 9 is 16 over 20 is equal to 20 over x. Cross multiply, 16x equals 400 divide by 16 and 400 divided by 16 is 25. On our next problem, we're looking at a um, picture, which will help us. So we have a tree that is casting a 50 meter shadow and a nearby flagpole is casting a 25 meter shadow. If the flagpole is 30 meters high, how tall is the tree? So x over 50 equals 30 over 25. Cross multiply 25x equals 30 times 50 is 1500. Divide by 25 and 60 is equal to x. Okay, the next one has a picture like this, and we're trying to figure out how long ED is. 
So I'm gonna say nine over two equals six over x. So nine x equals 12. So x is equal to 12 over nine. Divide top and bottom by three, which equals four thirds.